everybody. It's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls. Is that right? And <laughs> card flip out. This is the daily card reading for September 5th, 2021. What's happening? Believe and trust. Okay. Before, <laughs> before going to sleep tonight, say, Archangel Michael, please enter my dreams and replace fear with faith and trust. And then I heard lust. Hold on. We're going to talk about that. Hold on. Because that's part of that, you know, wasting your energy. Not that that has to be bad, but it should be backed up with some other things. You know what I mean? All right. Let me be filled with strength, courage, and confidence. So this is healing through the dream state, doing even dream programming. So this is meditating before you go to sleep, making sure that you're nice and clear because then your subconscious could get in there and start muddling up messages or what have you. Or, you know, the subconscious could be your friend, <laughs> right? Showing you what needs to be healed. Now, for some... Because if it was it yesterday, we were just talking about how people don't want to connect. Okay. They don't want to commit to one another. And then I heard lust. So there's something about, these are thought forms that have been put into people. And, and again, it goes down this road of like conquering and not getting involved and not learning your lesson from one another. Okay. So skipping along the surface. Um... I know this is kind of a weird message, but they're saying don't use and discard. Careful what you're doing with your energy. <laughs> because some of you, uh, you know, again, no judgment, but just be aware. I mean, there's something there where it feels like it's a thought form where people's interactions with one another, they're being blocked from their own power in that connection okay you feel me so that people don't become powerful there's this very surface level dynamic where usually you have a feeder okay a feeder soul and someone who is getting drained so and i guess this case the way they're kind of bringing it up it feels like it's like a person who is using another person and then the person who's getting used and then discarded and not always, but a lot of times we will see this with like a male, female, like hetero dynamic where sometimes, again, it's not across the board. Okay. I know that, but like where it's like the woman kind of gets used and the man's like, whatever, I just need to conquer the next person. Well, this is going to backfire on those people. I hear, I hear some of you cheering. <laughs> I hear some of you, this is very severely going to backfire on them, whether it's them getting exposed I just heard getting exposed, so I don't know what that means. I don't know if that means health-wise or their reputation goes. Listen, this isn't about being the morality police here. We're all learning our stuff, okay? I'm just offering, like, it's time for a better way for some people who engage in that, okay? Uh, it's not who you really are. Again, I'm not the moral police. Like, you do whatever you feel is right. You're on your soul's path. You know it better than anybody else. There's, like, there's somebody out there who's, like, super loving and caring. And that's not really your style, but it makes you look good somehow. And so, and it saves you from being rejected. We need you on, uh, on full power, Okay. And you're messing around, so knock it off. No, <laughs> if that's not authentic to who you are, um, you need to preserve that energy. This is a very awkward conversation to have, but hi, we're friends here, right? Okay, so that's <laughs> that's coming up. And so somebody might be sort of making a turn here and, and choosing a different way, okay? Again, if it feels right for you and everything's consenting and that's just where... Everybody is. That's fine. No judgment. I'm just sending this to somebody out there who doesn't want to do this anymore. But it's for image. It's for image. No, you do you. You you show up in the way that you want. You don't need to, and I'm, I'm feeling like this really needs to be heard by some people out there. You don't need to feel bad about wanting to have an authentic connection with another human being so long as it's healthy. Okay, where you're not having like a narcissist empath dynamic per se. But it's okay for you to love. I think that's what it is. It's okay for you to love. You came here to love. And some of you have been offered an extraordinary gift. And if you're fearful or if you're 
um, sort of under the pressure of friends and how they live their lives and maybe they'll make fun of you because you say, well, I love this person. (laughs) Whatever the deal is, we need everybody showing up authentically and being in their full power. So maybe it's more about living authentically uh, or honoring where you are now. Okay, maybe that was you at one time, but it doesn't work for you anymore. Whatever it is, however you interpret that, take that message with you and see what you can do with it. All right, we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.